What's going on, guys? Last Game 5 here, back with another Rubik's Cube video. So, yeah, um, yeah, I'm back with another Rubik's Cube video. So, yeah, I think I just scrambled this. But, that's exactly what we're going to be doing today. Now, you know, and, uh, you, you know, my last Rubik's Cube video, or should I say my first one ever, um, I could so side, it got, it got two likes, besides the two likes, I will teach you how to solve, of course, the, uh, one side. Well, um, I guess that's what we're going to be doing today, and a little bit something extra. So, yeah, let's just, uh, get into the video. Waste no time longer. So, yeah, so first what you want to do is make a cross. So, we're going to solve blue, for example. Let's just solve blue. So, um, sorry my directions are going to be very, very unclear, or un 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 unspecific because I'm not good at describing things but I'll try my best so you know um yeah so first um you want to like look for the centerpiece because remember the centerpieces don't actually move but they do turn uh, for example you see how you you see no matter how much I scramble this blue will always Stay in tax. So yeah. All right. So assuming you know everything about the Rubik's cube, about sides, corners, middle pieces, because I don't have time for that kind of stuff. Okay. Let's well, get right onto the video. So this probably will get marked for kids. I don't like that. But yeah. So first, you want to make a uh, cross. Now, um, now, um. So yeah. So you. So let's say you want to make like a um, a line here. So what you want to do is well search. So ignore these two halves of the cube. Look here and see hmm and see what oh, let's see what like edge pieces there are. So hmm, and there always should be an edge piece, right? So just ignore everything and see if there's edge piece. If you want, you can keep doing until there's edge pieces. So, apparently, this thing does not have any edge pieces. And that's okay. That means you can just move on to another thing. So, do the exact same thing. Alright? And then, see if, uh, edge pieces? Yes! There is a edge piece. Alright. Alright. So, yeah. So, um... Okay, uh, where is the blue? There we go. And then we turn this. So now we have a line here, alright? So, you know, just try to find edge pieces on the corners. Now, if you're stuck in a situation like this, which is really easy, all you have to do is uh, a few simple moves. Um, so yeah. Um, so, um,. Oh my gosh, this is hard to uh, make. Uh, so yeah, so you want to do, um, I think it's F inverted. I'm not completely sure. So you want to do that, and then you want to turn this like this. And then just bring this. Well, I don't know if I did it right, but I mean, now uh, I have a half to cross, and uh, yeah, I'm sorry if instructions are really unclear. Or if I'm just really bad at everything. Um, but yeah, I then try to find another corner piece. So, so, um, yeah, just try to find a corner piece in general, alright? So, uh, you know, just in general. Besides this. So, you can cover that if, uh, if you want. Aha! Three in a row! Hmm. How do you get that up there? Pretty easy. You just do this. Actually, no, because that's something there. So we're actually going to turn this. So then it could be a room for this. Now, um, now it's like this. So, so now we're going to, um, focus on this top layer without, without the, uh, blue thing. And so, 
Yeah. So now you're gonna try to find edge pieces. All right. There, there might be edge pieces be somewhere. There may not be. So here is an edge piece right here and right here. Now I'm just gonna flip corners until this is right. All right. You can say this is cheating all you want, but this is just how I do it. All right. Um. Now you can bring this um back down and uh yeah and then this and then boom and then what you want to do is try to get the uh um edge pieces like oh, oh my gosh like this edge piece right here so you want to get the edge piece see if it lines up and in this case it does not which is okay all right and then after that you just want to find the edge piece right um so yeah, so here's an edge piece right here. I mean, right here. So, yeah. And you want to try to find points where you can do it without missing the cube up. So then we're going to just turn this like this. And then we're going to turn it like this. And then just going to bring it all around here like this. Now you can just flip corners if you want, or if you know how to do it. Never mind, it's already solved. Yay! Now, now mine looks like this. So yeah, um, yeah, um. So it's actually really easy to do. All you do is this move, this move, and um, yeah. Of course, I messed it up because. Alright, guys, I'm really sorry. I'm just so bad at this. Wait, never mind. So, yeah. And so, then you want to do these moves down. Um, then this way. Then this way. And then it should look like this, which is good. And then check your edge piece, alright? So, so your second edge piece. So, my second edge piece is all the way back here. So, we're just going to move this up. And, uh, and it should be in line with the whole entire colors, which is good. So yeah, and then what you want to do is get this last SP, try to find the corner of it, of course. So right here, it's the corner of it right here. So then we can just move that. Okay, that is not a good angle for thing. Then we can just move it like that. And then just do this until it's solved. Now I'm really sorry. I was very unspecific. And yeah. Alright, so that's how you stop by. Sorry if I was unspecific. Yeah. Alright, guys, that will be all for today's video. Now, 